Solaris, anyway. Several billion miles away. That's gotta be a record. As you've begun to suspect, all of you have had your memories altered. You are Major Samantha Carter, Dr. Daniel Jackson, and your friend here is named Teal'c. Where does Homer fit in? You are all they sent down. It triggered what I later realized was a suppressed memory. You see, Colonel O'Neill, the truth is, I'm not just interested in outer space. I'm from outer space. Check, please. Who's he? Uh, my friend, Murray. You trust him? Oh, yeah. I guess it's okay for me, then. Don't you want to know how I found you? Uh, okay. I noticed in your car there was a map from the Sleep Right motel chain. I checked everyone in town. There's two. Well, I'm surprised a man in your position wouldn't take more precautions to maintain your cover. Marty, I'm not undercover. You think I'm making this all up? Look at this. Yes. It all makes sense now. Colonel Jack O'Neill, Major Samantha Carter, Dr. Daniel Jackson, allow me to introduce to you Lieutenant General Vadreen. Colonel. General. Major. General. Doctor. General. General Hammond has told me nothing but good things. Has he, sir? Well, then I'm sure he's left something out. Such as? Teal, you there, buddy? How does she fly, son? The vehicle performed within expected parameters. Woohoo! Sorry, sir. I couldn't help but get caught up in Teok's enthusiasm. We have sufficient power and life support for several days. Several days? Well, that's something. How long will this thing take to get to wherever it's going? Assuming this device is programmed to return to Apophis' original homeworld. Several hundred years. Several hundred years. Yeah, just uh, let me do the math on that here. Carry the four. It's going to be me, Teal'c, and the great outdoors. That means no cell phones, no fax machines, not another living soul for miles. We'll be unavailable, inaccessible. Incommunicado. Minnesota, sir. I stand correct. If there's an emergency back at the base, better plan ahead and tell me now. If Thor needs me, he's gonna have to beam me up. If the Tok'ra, forget it. Colonel O'Neill? Mellon. Mollum. Mollum. I'm sorry, it's the war, you know. What brings you here? Um, well, you know my friend, Teal'c. I missed him at the celebration. He's coming to town. I bought him a hat. They also appear to be able to phase through solid matter. Yeah, Teal'c and I saw one zip right on through a tree. Didn't even slow it down. That's so cool. It's exactly what I said. I said that. 
You look tense. No, I'd say anxious. I am neither tense nor anxious. Perhaps concerned. Who put her in charge? The U.S. Air Force. In medical matters, Dr. Fraser may overrule those of any rank. I'm not getting all my memos. I must say, Colonel, I was most intrigued by your means of arrival. Yeah, it's a sweet ride. A little rusty, but uh, still got zip. The last of the Toker have been evacuated, and the Stargate's been loaded into the cargo bay. We're good to go. say the first one's always the hardest. Let me say that. So, is it working? Is he, has he said anything? He talked about fabric briefly. He just called me a woman. So I think it's working. Well, something's happening. How's Sam? Hammond recommended a psych evaluation. Do you believe Major Carter has become mentally unstable? No more than the rest of us. What do you guys got? Hey guys, what are you doing here? We brought pizza in a movie, Star Wars. He's seen it, what, eight times? Nine. Nine times. If Teal'c likes it, it's gotta be okay. You've never seen Star Wars? Yeah, you know me and sci-fi. Now what? I have read of a place where humans do battle in a ring of jello. Call Daniel. I assume you can see me. Yes. Did Freyer mention why I'm here? Yes, Colonel. They're aware of the circumstances surrounding your request. Oh, hey, there you are. Didn't see you. You guys all kind of look. Thor's not here, eh? Nareem said in order for the device to work on both of us, we must hold hands on you. I know. And I suppose when Earth gets hit by that rock and we're all wiped out, that's going to be unfortunate, too. Very. And after that, I kind of lost my temper. What exactly does that mean? Let's just say Jack made a reference to Frere's mother. We'll discuss Colonel O'Neill's diplomatic shortcomings later. Right now, I'd like to know what options remain. And their leader, Colonel O'Neill. Tech my tech. Back at you. Back at you. Hey, you, in the skirt. Get that target swinging a little. Oh, yeah. Tomorrow, we're going to raid a supply shipment intended for a battalion of Nertes Jafar. Join us. If we do, what's in it for us? I see you are one who speaks your mind, O'Neill. Yes, which is why I don't say much.